Yo, what's good boys? It's uh, Josh back with another video. Um, today, I'm coming at you guys with a CPU optimization guide for Fortnite Battle Royale in Chapter 2 Season 2. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd make another performance guide video because my last two uh, FPS slash performance guide uh, videos that I've made have done pretty well. Um, the last video I made, the FPS guide part 2. <clears throat> got like 250 views in 24 hours which is really good for my channel um, so if you guys want to check out either part one or part two I'll have them linked in the description as well as um, the programs that I use in the video so uh, yeah if you guys enjoy make sure to drop a like and subscribe it really uh, helps me out and it's free for you guys to do so yeah I'm gonna get straight into it um, so the first thing you want to do is hit your Windows key in R which is run or you could just type in run here on your search bar click on that <clears throat> you're going to type in ms config press ok it should bring up this thing right here um for this just make sure that you have the same thing selected as me load uh, system services load up startup items or whatever um and then you're going to want to go over to the boot tab right here click on advanced and the first thing you'll want to do this should be unchecked for you guys uh, make sure you check it and select the maximum number that you can right here for your number of processors Which is also the number of cores that your CPU has which is a good thing to know if you guys want to know How many cores your CPU has just right click on your taskbar on the very bottom click on task manager Go over to performance and you see the CPU tab right here. You should see cores right there right where my cursor is so I have a quad core CPU uh, which is four so I'm gonna put in four right here All right I'm gonna press OK and yeah so then after you do that make sure you just press apply OK um, I'm gonna go like this exit without restart um, in order for these changes to apply on your PC you're gonna have to restart your PC obviously um, but since I have another step or another two steps for you guys to do uh, just do exit without restart and once you've finished watching this video um, you guys can restart your PC so I'm gonna do exit without restart alright guys so the next step you're gonna want to do is uh, type in the bottom left corner you're gonna want to look up performance monitor you're gonna right click and run it as administrator and this screen should pop up right here you should see some stuff right here and get some information about your PC um, so what you're gonna want to do is go over to data collector sets user defined and in this white space you should have nothing but if you do that's whatever just right click in the white space go over to new new data collector set you're gonna want to name it CPU create manually advanced Click on next and then the only thing you're gonna want to check right here is you're gonna click on performance counter and then next so the first thing for performance counters, you're going to want to add, you're going to let it load. So processor right here uh, is a simple one. You're going to want to go to the max, which for me is three. It could be different for you guys. So then just go, okay. All right. Oh, my bad. One sec. Uh, you you got to, I clicked on the wrong thing. So process, processor, three, add. You should see it come right here, right? And then the next one is process. You're going to bring this drop down menu and you're going to scroll down to thread count and then for this what you're going to want to do is just click on add right you don't want to click any of these things right here i don't know why these are up here but <clears throat> and click on thread count and just press add and then once you're done this just click on ok next doesn't matter where you save it to next and finish so right here you should have it added right here uh, you can just go on exit out of this and the last thing you want to do is a program that I have linked in the description it's called quick CPU uh, the link to download it will be down there uh, so once you download it just make sure you drag it to your desktop just click on it my screen's gonna go black quickly because I have to run it as administrator and then when you open it you should see a screen similar to this and the only thing that you guys have to do for this one is just where it says these things right here you're gonna want to drag all of these three bars to 100% click on apply and close and the final step for today's video is I have a command one sec, command line 
Fortnite. I have a command line that I used in my past two performance videos that really help. Um, so for this command, um, it's a it's a command line for when you're launching Fortnite, so Fortnite knows and it's optimized for the number of cores that your processor has. So same thing um, right here. This is going to be the number of cores. <clears throat> I'm just gonna write that down. Number of number is the number of cores your CPU has. Sorry, I can't type for shit right now. Um, so pretty much for to find this number out, same thing. Just right click on the bottom bar, click on Task Manager, go over to Performance and CPU. You should, you should see the number of cores. So I have four. So I'm going to put four right there. And you're just going to copy this command, boot up into the Epic Games Launcher. Once you're in, click on Settings, scroll down to where it says Fortnite right here. You're going to want to for for you guys. It should say this is unchecked. So you're going to check it. And then you're going to want to copy and paste that command line in. So then Fortnite knows when it's going to launch, how many cores your CPU has, so how it needs to be optimized for your PC to run as well as possible. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, uh, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, uh, give me a comment down below. I will be actively answering your guys' uh, questions and if you guys are having any problems, um, if you leave a comment down below, I should be able to answer it within like 10-15 um, minutes because I have my YouTube notifications turned on. So yeah, uh, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and give me a sub if you're new. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out guys. What's poppin'? Who you a Brand new whip just, just hopped in. I got oh, options. I can pass that bitch like stockin'. Just joshin'. I'm spending this holiday locked in. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top ten. I can put the ball in the end zone, put a bad bitch in the friend zone. This shit sound like an intro jet song. Give me that.